the international community is complicit in silence when it doesn't acknowledge or take into a public space and discourse the fact that sexual violence happens, political sexual violence, when women are targeted as women as a, an instrument of war, and the kind of common sexual violence. For all of them, there is a fundamental paradox for the international community of those who are seeking to help. So for these mothers, silence may be something that is protective and you know, is agentive, so they are protecting their children. But on the other hand, there is a need for acknowledgement of what has happened within public discourse. So there is a need for them to see and recognise that at some level, this is what they have experienced and what their children will experience is wrong. Identifying uh, victims of sexual violence is very complicated. Uh, we had a research project in Sierra Leone, Northern Uganda and uh, Liberia and we started with young women themselves and were identified as vulnerable by the community and then they identified other young women. So often they will know themselves you know, through their intimate networks who have been victims of sexual violence. So we brought them together, organised them in groups, um, they defined their priorities, resources were put in, they had control over the spending of the money to develop projects that they felt would best match what they needed. So they developed individual income generation projects, group projects, you know, group garden cultivation. And as they did this, others in the community supported them as community advisors. And more powerful people were looking in and became motivated and interested to support them. So one community leader gave land, another would have advocated for them. And over the three or four years, Three quarters of them um, said that they felt more loved by family, that their children were better accepted, that the health of their children was better. More needs to be done, but it's a very interesting model of what can be done.